We have less than six years to dramatically reduce fossil fuel emissions to keep warming below 1.5 degrees Celsius. Hi, I'm Ted Rack, and I'm sick and tired of scientists telling us mean bad facts about our world in confusing ways. So I have a show now, or I have these folks come on and make them tell us their terrible message in a way that's easier to swallow. This is, come on now, you expect me to believe that? You expect me to believe that? I don't. No way. You come on, me no that. way. You expect me to believe that? First up, I hooked him up with some new fashion. Now I've asked you to wear this funny shirt so I'll be more receptive and less hostile to the stuff you're gonna try and tell me, okay? Plus it's a really funny shirt and if I ever get bored, I can look down. You expect me to believe that? All right, let's focus on making your messaging a little more appealing to someone like me. Someone who like, when I hear it, I get like a little mad because I don't understand it. And I get a little irritated because I don't know what you're talking about. So like a normal guy, can you explain to me why I should care about climate change? Okay. So the earth exists in a delicate balance. It gets warmer because of the sun and it has to cool itself off by emitting radiation to space. As humans, we've been burning fossil fuels and that puts gases in the atmosphere that act like a heat trapping blanket. The Earth can respond to that by warming up its temperatures and sending more heat out to space, coming back into balance. The problem is when it warms up, that leads to all kinds of consequences for us on the ground, like heat waves, rain and floods and drought, ecological disruptions, all kinds of other environmental disasters. Fuck. I gotta be honest. What you're saying to me makes me want to fight you a little. Come on, no way! Uh, your social media. It's so depressing, it's, and it's freaky. Like, what the hell are you talking about? The Gulf Stream's gonna collapse? It's like, relax. Well, yeah, so unfortunately, the Gulf Stream overturning current system is on pace to collapse which hasn't happened in at least 12,000 years. Sorry. Sorry about that. Why don't, you just, why don't you try something fun, like a fun factor, an icebreaker, to help people in so they don't, aren't just instantly pissed off at you. For me, my go-to fun fact is when I was a little baby, I was a smiley baby. Something like that, icebreaker, a fun fact. So how much heat do you think is added to the atmosphere every day by burning fossil fuels? 20 pounds. Okay, so it's about the same amount as a million Hiroshima bombs. I'm gonna punch you. No way, you expect me to believe that? Just don't keep this stuff up here. If, you, if this is all you think about, you're gonna, you're gonna be in a bad mood all the time. It's my job. Yeah, I know. Sucks. All right, well, let me try and help you a little bit here. Why don't you tell me something you say in one of your speeches, and I'll fix it for you. I'll help you out. We only have six years to reduce fossil fuel emissions to keep warming below 1.5 degrees Celsius. That doesn't sound like a lot. It's a catastrophic amount of warming. When it happens over the whole planet and stays that way for a long time, it means melting of glaciers and ice sheets, changing forest cover, changing ocean circulation, currents to slow down, corals to bleach, trees to die, sea levels to rise. Here's what you should say. Hey, hey everybody, you know your house? Your house is about to be part of the ocean. And all your pictures, pictures with you and your buddies, that's gonna get wrecked by ocean water. And a shark could swim in there and eat a picture of your daddy. It's fucked up. It's fucked up stuff right there. I'm glad you're concerned. I, I am too. Try that. I got you a little something. Oh. Yeah. Thanks. That's yours. That's yeah. cool. It's really cool. It broke the road. 
And with that, I taught him everything I could. It's now up to him to save the world, because I've already saved my portion. This has been really fun. You're a good guy. All right, guys, here's the deal. If we don't get global warming under control, we're gonna have sharks on land. They're gonna eat everything you love. Your signed baseball cards, your DVD collection, that yearbook where Christina Thompson wrote, you turned into a man this year. We need to preserve these things.